Hello all, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the Chasing Speed series. This is episode 15 and this is going to be a really cool video. We've got 200 reaps to use on Lighthouse's account. He's been saving up forever and we've been waiting to get quality runes that are worth reapping. And we have some good reap targets. Let's see how we do. Can we get any quad rolls? Speed, crit rate, crit damage, even HP percent. But what we're really doing is chasing speed, right? We're back on Here Gang member Lighthouse's account. Lighthouse has been saving up reaps forever. He's up to 238. Oh my god! Uh, we're not going to use all of them, but we are going to use 200. So with 200 reaps, how many quad rolls can we get? I'm excited to try this out, so let's get started. And just one other note, we also have 37 ancient rune reaps. So we will try to use probably about 20 of those. So we use the rune marking system. Four is kind of what I consider the best reaps, and five are other potential reaps but those are going to be less likely to be good. 53 that are marked as number five. And we only have 12 that are marked as number four. So, so they're either slots two, four, and six with like an innate, or they're just a stat that he's really, that he really needs. Um, or they're a slot one, three, and five with an innate stat. It's probably worth mentioning really quickly that when you're doing reaps, what you really want to shoot for are the rune sets you use the most. So that would be Violent, Will, Rage, Swift, Despair. And then maybe a little bit you can look at uh, Nemesis or Destroy. Uh, but you're generally not going to be using those nearly as much. So I try to stick to those top rune sets. And then you want to try to stick to slots 2, 4, and 6 for the for the main stat that you're missing the most where you don't have many quality slot 4 HP percent or quality slot 4 crit damage. You're trying not to re-up a rune just for a monster because if you end up not using that monster in the future and that rune ends up not being very useful on other monsters, you've wasted re-ups. So those are some re tips that I wanted to share before we get started. One more shout out to Yukino for uh, really dramatically cleaning up the runes here on Lighthouse's account. He did a ton of work and now we're left with 75 runes that are marked as either a reap or a really nice reap chance. And you know 200 reaps sounds like a ton but actually that's probably only going to get you maybe 10 good runes. Uh, about 10 to 20 reaps per rune until you get something decent. So we're just going to look at the ones that I've marked as really strong reap candidates. We've got one wheel rune, slot one, uh, HP percent here, HP, HP defense, HP speed will probably do. I don't know if we'll really do any of those. Those aren't the top rune sets, maybe nemesis, uh, but this is despair and it's my only ancient one that's marked as a really good candidate. So we'll, we'll probably do a few ancient reaps into that. And we've got Swift and Violent here. Uh, Swift, we got three crit damage and an HP percent. A couple of uh, Violence for slot five. And then we've got three HP percent and two attack percent. So that slot six looks really promising. I hope we can get something good out of that. So we're going to start with slots two four and six and when you're doing reaps you just have to see like how many times you're going to put reaps into it until you, you realize that rune is just not rolling well and you need to stop so you don't throw 200 reaps into one room so 37 ancient 238 regular reaps and so we're, we're seeing how many quad rolls can we get out of this and and also just how many like just really solid quality runes and like high efficiency. So here we go. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so that really hasn't improved at all. I mean, we have speed on it now, but with ancient runes, especially if you're not farming ancient grinds and gems very much, you're just really looking for a high efficiency rune because you're not expecting to get the grinds and gems that you want for it. So we'll do we'll do one more. That's garbage. Okay, we may come back to that one later. Um, I'm not really excited about any of these slot twos except this will speed room. So we had 238 reaps. I'm gonna try to put like five to eight into each one and see how we see how we do, and then uh, we can. Our goal is to use about 200. Yeah. So that's basically a uh, triple roll into accuracy and one roll into HP. So it's not often you get triple rolls into one stat. And that's not better. So we're gonna we're gonna leave this one. And that's eight reaps into that. We're gonna leave that for now. Um, we're gonna come down to slot four. Now these are probably worth more reaps because they slot four is really hard to get good stuff. Um, yeah, so with the crit damage, we're looking for like a triple crit rate roll. Uh, we don't, you know, eleven percent crit rate is not enough. No crit rate there. Now you will also take speed if you get a triple or quad roll into speed. You can get your crit rate somewhere else. Um, so these are these we're going to put some work into. So we're going to see what we can do with this one. Uh, this needs speed and crit rate, and then you're looking for like attack percent, HP percent. So one thing you could look at with Swift is if you get really nice crit rate, really nice attack, then you could look at do I gem in speed for like this defense percent. Um, we're gonna leave that one for a little bit. That looks at least better. Now we're gonna try to fix this one. Okay, so this one also is just complete garbage. So this is a rage one too. We really want, we want really nice stats on a rage rune. Now this one does not have an innate, so that makes the, well, that's not horrible. So it's one roll into speed, two rolls into crit rate, uh, just low efficiency and one roll into attack and then you can ch you can gem out the defense percent for something else um, we're going to leave that one for a little bit come back to it and see what we can do with this one okay one more and then we're going to move on because we have some we have some nice slot sixes. Well, we're going to throw a few into this one. Power this up to plus 12. Garbage stats. And then we're going to just do a few reappraisals. Can we just get some speed on this? In speed on this one. Here's 17. Okay, we're going to stop on that one for a little bit. Because these two HP percents are actually more valuable in terms of having a better chance at speed. And both of those would be really useful. So now what we're looking for is synergistic stats, almost certainly a support monster. Hey, there's 17 speed. So that's a double roll into speed, missing one efficiency. Um, and it looks like one flat HP and one attack percent. 
But this would actually be, you could gem out crit damage uh, and you can grind it up to, to 23. Uh, 21, sorry. 21 with a hero. We might come back to that one, but we're going to leave that for now because it had no speed before. Now it's got 17. Uh, so let's see how this one does. Uh, just, I've been really liking my despair runes uh, since they changed how despair works. I think they're much more valuable in PvP. So now you have monsters that would normally glance on somebody and not stun stunning them now. So here's 15 speed. But almost max accuracy, uh, a low roll into resistance. So that's not a great rune, but it's very synergistic and you can uh, you can grind two of them. So that's an 18 speed rune. We're going to keep that around for a little bit. So we've improved that from uh, you know, these didn't have speed, and then now it's 17 and 14. Uh, let's see what we can get. This is garbage, so let's let's see if we can improve this one. Okay, one more. Oh, these are bad. Okay. So we now have that, that... Get this to plus 12. Not willing to give up that 25%. Ooh. Uh, so this is a problem. <laughs> got one roll into attack flat. And then you've got a triple roll into speed. It's missing two speed. We're going to take the speed. Um, we're going to throw two more into this. And then we're going to move on. Yeah, we're going to move on from this one. 22 speed is not horrible uh, for a nuker rune. It's just the rest of these stats are garbage. You can, you can gem out the resistance for crit rate and then grind the attack flat and HP flat and speed. If you put a hero grind on this, it's 26 speed. So it's not... Okay. So we really don't see much here that I really want to work on. So if we're able to... So if we're to throw... defense percent on this and then grind everything that's probably a pretty good rune so let's grind that up let's put that in there Ugh, come on Could be better than that it's gonna ugh. come on there we go 10 percent we'll take that so then we've got Six percent. Oh my god. Five percent there. Can we get six? And we got a four. Another four. Oh, come on. There we go. Seven. Okay. So. That is a nice thick rune. Uh, we're going to power this up to plus 15. And we're going to throw that into chat. It's not a bad rune. It's a really good support rune uh, for supports that need to do debuffs. And if they also heal by attack percent, that's not bad. Um, 
this is garbage but it's got a really nice innate so let's see if we can throw a few reaps into this so that's speed hp resistance and then accuracy and then you can gem in something else that would make sense i don't know we'll leave that one alone for a little bit so this is simply can we get speed on it sure this rune is, is feeling it. I just wanted to see. Oh, there's 15. Okay, that's actually not bad. So that's double roll in the speed. Um, one roll in the crit damage. Two rolls in the crit damage. So those are low rolls. But 15 speed on a swift. Let's see what this one can do. Double roll into HP, missing three efficiency. Double roll into defense, missing one efficiency. Crit damage you could gem out. It's missing one speed. I don't know. It's better than it was. We have 61 left. And we really haven't hit a home run on any of these runes yet. Let's see if there's any other runes in the other reap pile that might be worth our time. There's probably a few worth at least touching a few reaps on these. Uh, I don't think I'm going to do anything There we go. That one's done. It's got 14 speed now. Um, crit rate, attack percent, crit damage, speed, resistance sucks, but we got nothing good. Just a couple into this one. Hey, look at that. Crit rate, crit damage, attack percent, accuracy. That's way better. Um, yeah, I don't think we need to touch that one anymore. That's nice. Um, we'll probably even take that off the re-up list. That's, that's a rune worth keeping around now. Um, and I think we had one, yeah, we've got one attack percent here. Can we get a quad roll into the crit rate? No, we can't. And this is a blade rune, so I'm not looking for, oh, hello. 23% crit damage. Um, speed, defense. I mean, it's not a great rune, but it's a blade rune. You don't want to spend a ton of reaps on a blade. Um, so that's a triple crit damage roll, missing only 1% efficiency. And then one roll into HP flat. I don't know. It's better than before. So attack percent will are very valuable. Can throw a few into this one. I mean, that's an improvement already. Still not great. But 16 speed, so that could be a 20 speed rune. Ooh, even better. Okay, I think we're done with that one. So, 17 speed, 70% crit rate. So, two rolls into each. Both pretty efficient. Um, you throw a hero grind on that, and it's a 21 speed rune. That's a nice rune. So, we're going to switch that over to, it's no longer a re -app. It's 20 plus speed. Let's see if we can improve this one just as much. That's probably about as good as we're going to be able to get. So 17 speed, 11 crit rate, 
one roll into defense percent, but then we can gem out defense flat for accuracy, HP, probably HP or attack percent, and then it's triple grindable. That's a pretty decent ring now. Vio, HP percent, let's try to make this one better. I'm gonna wait to gem it, depending on what monster this goes on. But we can, do we have a speed? So let's use this one, because we're guaranteed to get up to 20. And we got to 21. So let's power this up. Uh, let's put some defense on it. Okay, <laughs> some defense, I said. Um, can share that to chat. Mm -hmm. So that's a double roll into speed plus a grind. Mm -hmm. You get just a little bit of speed on this one. Hey, 18. Eighteen, that's worth using a hero. So that's twenty-two. That's worth putting speed a, a hero on. It's twenty-five speed. Okay, anybody else that we can make pretty? Um, that's not bad. Uh, and we've got, let's make this one 21. Yep, yeah, we got it. Get some nice fat attack on there for a, a healer that does healing off attack. Put some HP percent or HP flat on there. That was terrible. Try that again. Still terrible. There we go. Um, and then we need accuracy, probably. That's not bad. That is not bad at all, folks. That's a nice looking rune. Uh, we're going to power that up to 15. Share that to chat. That's looking pretty good. Okay, so... That one was the only quad speed we got today. Uh, but hey, it's a quad speed. Uh, 24 speed there. And then we, th that was actually not from a reap. That was just a straight roll. And then this, all the rest of these are reaps. So 26% accuracy with at least 13% on everything else. That's not a bad will rune. Violet rune, HP percent with 21 speed. It's really good. Swift Rune with 22 speed. Attack percent with 25 speed. And a Swift HP percent with 21 speed with a lot of attack, extra HP, defense, and accuracy. So, um, so we got one, two, three, four, five solid reaps out of a little over 200. <laughs> Sorry, Lighthouse, I went slightly over. Um, but hey, he should be pretty happy with those speed numbers. That should help him speed up some of his boosters at, at the bare minimum. So um, anyway, uh, just kind of wanted to show you guys what you could get with, uh, you know, and the, those were probably about average reaps. Uh, I don't think we had an amazing reap session. I don't think we had a horrible one. It's That's about average. So... Um, hope you enjoyed seeing this. I've never even come close to 200 reaps on my account. Um, 
This was a lot of fun. Uh, we will see you guys in the next one.